for a 15 minute upper body workout today that's gonna work your chest, arms and back. And all you need is a set of dumbbells or filled water bottles. The full daily schedule is on my website along with daily recipes. It's all free for you and also do share your progress with the rest of the community on Discord, Instagram and YouTube because we're all in this together. Smash that thumbs up button and leave a comment down below and let's get started. We've got 21 exercises across 4 sets in this upper body workout today, 30 to 40 seconds on and 5 to 20 seconds off. You'll need a set of dumbbells for this workout, but please be safe while working out with equipment and make sure you're using right weights for your ability. More details are in the description. Get on your mat and let's start the workout with narrow chest press. Set your dumbbells on your hips, then slowly lay back on the mat. Bend your knees, then press the weights up over your chest by contracting your triceps and chest. Slowly lower the weight until both elbows touch the mat, then press your dumbbells back up again and repeat. You should be able to do 8 to 10 reps with a bit of a challenge at the end. If it's too easy or too hard, you need to use a more appropriate set of weights. Put aside your dumbbell safely and stand upright. Just a short rest and we're doing shoulder press. Hold your dumbbells above your shoulders, then press upwards and lower them down slowly. Be safe and make sure you're not using weights that are too heavy here. Make sure they're challenging enough but not too difficult or not too easy. Make sure your back is straight and you're not slouching forward. Ten seconds rest now, put your dumbbells down and rest if you need to. Next we've got bent over row. Start by leaning forward to a 45 degree angle or you can go a little bit more parallel to the floor. Keep your back straight and you're gonna lift your dumbbells upwards in a rowing like motion. This is gonna work your lats. Nice work guys, another 10 seconds rest here so rest your arms if you need to. Next we've got lateral raise variations. Start with your dumbbells to your side while standing straight then raise it up. One arm lifting forward and the other off to the side, bring it back down and alternate those movements. You are working your front and side delts here. You're doing great guys, put one dumbbell aside and next we've got tricep extension. The last exercise of the first set. Make sure you have a firm grip of your dumbbell and carefully raise it behind your head like so. Make sure your elbow is not flaring out too much and we're gonna do some extensions here. Working those triceps and make sure your upper arms stay stationary. And that's set one. Take a longer break if you need to. It's totally fine, especially with heavier weights. It is recommended to take more breaks in between exercises or sets when you're using heavier weights. We're gonna start the next set with Renegade Row. So place two dumbbells on the mat while you're in a high plank position. Now raise one elbow up, then repeat on the other arm. Just go nice and slow if you need to, just make sure you're engaging your core and you're not hurting yourself. Thank you. 
Next, we're doing a bicep curl into a shoulder press. So stand upright, shake those arms real quick and get ready with your dumbbells to your side. Start with a bicep curl. Don't move your upper arms while performing these curls, then press it into a shoulder press. Let's give your shoulders and biceps a good workout. You're doing great guys, just a couple more and we'll be done with the second set. Now we've got rear delt fly. With the dumbbells by the side of your body, bend forward in a 45 degree angle or you could go almost parallel to the floor. Then lift your dumbbells up to the side until your shoulder blades touch each other. This is going to work your rear delts and this is a great exercise, one of my favorites. Make sure your back is straight and your neck is in a neutral position. Place one dumbbell aside and we're only gonna use one over here. We've got tricep kick back next. Lean forward slightly and now we're gonna take a step back with one leg while extending your other arm. Then bring it back in and repeat. This is gonna work our triceps and our legs. And keep going guys, you're doing great. Just a 5 seconds rest here and we're swapping to the other side. Make sure your upper arms stay stable while you're doing tricep kickback. Last exercise of the set, we've got lateral raises. Make sure you're standing upright and with your dumbbells to your side, we are lifting them up laterally, working your side delts. Make sure your elbows do not pass your shoulders and lower the weights down slowly, working those delts. That's the second set. Halfway through the workout, take a longer rest if you need to. Lay on your mat, dumbbells held up but with the knees and elbows bent. We did narrow chest press earlier and now we're doing wide chest press instead. Press the weights upwards over your chest by contracting your triceps and chest. Make sure you don't lock out your elbows while you press your dumbbells upwards, especially if you're using heavier weights. Put those dumbbells aside and stand upright safely. We've got hammer curl press next. Have your upper arm stable. Now curl the dumbbell in a neutral grip, then press upwards, working those shoulders. I'm not
Great work guys, we've got bent over row. You've done this earlier in the first set, you're bending forward and we're doing some rows. You're doing great guys, remember to rest if you need to, it's all about progression over time. Work on your form and getting familiar with the exercises is more important. Now with dumbbells in front of you, we're lifting them upwards, working your shoulders. Make sure your elbows do not go higher than your shoulders. This is gonna work your front delts. Just two more and we're done with set three guys. Next, get on your mat again and we've got plank row. Bring the dumbbell behind you one at a time while in a high plank. Try to not sway your hips from side to side. I know it's difficult, but try your best and engage your core here. Nice work guys, now get upright and let's finish this set with another round of rear delt fly. Keep going, you can do it. And that's the third set, just four more exercises to go and take a longer rest if you need to. Put your dumbbells aside and let's start the last set with narrow push-ups. Just do it on your knees if you find this too difficult. For the rest of us, have your elbows tucked in for a narrow push-up or you can always widen it to a 45 degree angle and do a full push-up. It depends on what you want to work on. Now stand upright and we're doing another round of lateral race variations. Just like before, lift one arm forward and the other to the side, bring them back down and alternate those movements. Just two more exercises after this. Just a short 5 seconds rest here and we're going into tricep kickbacks with just one dumbbell. Just like before, lean forward a little. Now take one step back with one leg and the other arm extended behind you. Make sure your upper arm stays stable. This is gonna work your triceps. And final exercise, let's swap to the other side.
And that's the workout, guys. Hope you're enjoying this weighted program. Please, please, please leave a comment down below and make sure you smash that like button for me. And I'll see you in the next workout. Bye.